क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज नेम द फॉर्म एनिमल्स रिपीट आफ्टर मी खाओ शीप हॉर्स डॉग हैन डक खाओ शीप हॉर्स डॉग हैन एंड डक क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इज वेर डू दे लिव सो नंबर वन इज काओ काओ लिवज इन काओ शेड काओ लिवज इन काओ शेड नंबर टू शीप शीप लिवज इन बैरन शीप लिवज इन बैरन नंबर थ्री इज डॉग डॉग लिवज इन कैनल डॉग लिवज इन कैनल नंबर फोर इज हैन हैन लिवज इन हैन हाउस हैन लिवज इन हैन हाउस नंबर फाइव इज हॉर्स हॉर्स लिवज इन स्टेबल हॉर्स लिवज इन स्टेबल क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इज वट डज फार्म एनिमल्स गिव अस दे गिव अस एग्स मिल्क एंड मीट एग्स मिल्क एंड मीट वट डज दे गिव अस दे गिव अस एग्स मिल्क एंड मीट today from the countdown book we we will do page number 23 and it is saying that shapes have faces shapes have faces so what we have to do we actually i will today just give you the concept that what the book is saying today fine so you have to just write the date and day at the top now look at the picture the page number very carefully look at this cube Which shape is it? It's cube. Which shape? Cube shape. Okay. It has a face here. Now this cube shape is having a face over here. Find the angry face or the sad face. And it has another face here. Can you see? It's already having the face here, and then this this side is also a face. How many faces can you count all together? When we come put the cube shape in front of you, yeah, in front of anybody, then how many faces this cube have? Now, what you will do, you need to find out the cube shape at your home. See that, observe that, find, and then you have to tell that how many. faces you have been counting all together use a dice or a box to help you fine you can take any box or a dice now look at the shape of each face now for your help if you couldn't find any shape at your home you can easily count the faces from there like this cube is having 1 2 3 4 Five, six, six faces. How? One, two, three, four, five, and the back one six. So how many faces? Six. Each face is a square. Each face is a square. They have given you the shape of square as well, right? Each face is a square. Now. look you can see this is also square shape this is also square shape this is also square shape this one will also be and back one also be and the bottom one also be so each face is a square shape these all shapes are of square shapes now look for a squares in your classroom so right now we are not in the classroom so you have to find this at your home fine so cubes have cube have six faces how many faces cube have six faces now let's move to page number 24 
this is page number 24 okay more about faces more about faces other shapes have flat faces too now can you see this look at this cuboid this is cuboid it is also having a flat faces how it has long face it has long faces like this one is long one this is not a square right it's not a square the short faces so as compared to this shape this one is short face fine how many rectangle rectangular faces can you count so how many rectangle faces would cube cuboid would have can you count them let's do it one two three the bottom one the behind one four five this one is the fifth and this one would be six use a book or a pencil box to help you look at the shapes of each faces now if you uh, if you if you couldn't find the shape at your home again they have given you the faces so let's count them shape number 1 rectangular rectangular number 1 2 the short rectangular 3 4 and again the big rectangular so fifth and sixth so these the, they also have how many rectangulars six each face is a rectangle each face is a rectangle now this is also rectangle this one is also a rectangle now the short faces are also rectangle all the two parallel sides are equal right four sides are not equal but opposite side is equal to each other right so this is also rectangle so each face is a rectangle find more rectangles in your classroom again they are asking you for the classroom so but we don't we don't have we are not in the classroom so you have to find it at your home more shapes and their faces this is cylinder two has flat faces now which one is the flat face this one is the flat face this one is the flat face it has one on top the top one this is a flat shape flat face and another at the bottom so you can see that the bottom and at the top they both are flat faces these flat faces are circles so their shape is actually of a circle this is a curved face of a cylinder now the old the round one it's a curved face of a cylinder can you find that flat face on the cone where is the flat face on the cone now this is the flat face right it too is a circle it too is a circle now this cone uh, the cone flat face is also of a circle shape let's move to the last page and that is the triangle the shape with three sides the shape with the three sides look at this building building block this is building block fine it has three long faces like these long faces they are rectangles they are rectangles right two opposite sides are equal they are not in a square shape so these are rectangle it also has two small faces like this this is the main shape now where are the tri triangle uh, rectangles tri rectangle number 1 at the back of this is also a rectangle and at the bottom is also a rectangle so how many shape 1 2 3 now this one is a triangle 
and at the back there is another triangle so there are two triangles these faces are triangles these faces are triangles now there is an activity for you over here that you have to make a paper triangle how make your own triangles from a square piece of paper now parents do provide a square paper square size paper to the students and ask them to make a triangle with it now kids how you have to make it this is a piece of a paper like this you have you will be having the paper fold that paper in this position corner to corner edges to edges with the help of your parents cut along the fold there will be a fold once you are done with this you open that page you will see a line over here with the help of your parent cut that page and there will be a two triangles color each triangle fine and all the shapes read them the way i have done it for you and color all the shapes this shape uh, triangle shape uh, this building block all the shapes of building block and then all the pictures from the cylinder you have to color them and then you have to color this uh, cube board also and you have to color this cube also we will not do this page today just color that page clear your concepts and next time we will going to do this page number 27 today from the workbook we have that word comes in between right now we have to write the middle number now you can see that it is starting from 3 and the middle one is empty and then there's a five number so what comes between them number 4 will come 15 12 17 what comes after 15 16 what will come Forty-five, forty-six. So this is the work of today. Do it and show me in the graph. In the math written work today, we have the missing numbers from one sixty to two hundred, and the date is fourth September two thousand twenty. The day is Friday. What we did. what i did actually we have done the counting previously the forward counting from 160 to 120 today i have just written a simple counting from 168 to 185 fine and i have left some of the dashes between them so that students can easily write the answer 
So students, what you have to do, you just have to start counting with me and you have to write the answers. You have to tell me the answers in the blanks, right? The word will come in the blanks and then we will write it in that. Clear? I will write it for you in the video, but once you will do the work, you have to do it in the same way that I am doing, right? So, 168, let's start counting from 168. 168, 169, what will come in the dash? 170, what will come in the dash? 170. Okay, 171, 168, 169, 170, 171, 172, 173, 174, 175, 176, good, 177, 178, and what will come after 178? 179. Great. 180. What will come after 180? 181. Great. 182. And then 180. 183. 184. And what is the last number? 180. Five. Great. So this is the work of your written, written work of maths completed.